it's Sunday. I've just dropped Anna off from, sorry, to the airport. She's on her way to Italy to see her mum and dad. I'm driving up through Thetford Forest and I'm gonna go for some walks. Uh, the first place I'm gonna go is a place called Castle Acre, which is a ruined castle. And I'm gonna try and go up to the Norfolk coast. Um, weather's quite nice today, it's about 18 degrees now, as we see. So we'll see how far we get. So first stop on the way, I'm at uh, Swatham Waitrose. I'm just gonna pick up some bits to eat for lunch on the way. Um, but something interesting here is the, um, I think it's called the Br Green Britain Centre or something like that. Um, they've got a windmill and they've had it here for quite a few years, um, probably over 10 years. Um, but you can take tours up the windmill so there's if you look at the top of the windmill there you can see a glass observation desk so you can go up it and um, have a look over the landscape and I think there's, there's an information centre there as well um, so I'm just going to stop and get some lunch here and then Castle Lake is just about another two miles down the road I've driven from Castle Acre up through uh, Holt in North Norfolk and I've now got to Baconthorpe Castle which is a small village called Baconthorpe just outside Holt and this is a sort of ruins of a castle so I'm going to do some video in here and walk around been coming here since I was a kid with my mum and dad so it's quite cool we've stayed in the village in a and b before um, so it's quite a nice place we know well. Um, so I'm just going to eat my lunch here. So I've got some food from Waitrose. I got um, a baguette, some rocket, uh, some tomatoes to put in it, and some watermelon to go with it. Um, so I'm just going to eat that, and then I'm going to have a walk around the castle. I've driven from Castle Acre up part back past Holt um, through Langham and across to Stiff Keith past Blakeney and I'm now at the marshes just on the edge of the village um, and I'm going to go for a walk across them um, and across the, the bridge out to the uh, sea there's some sand further out um, depending on how far the, the tide is in, it looks like it's right out at the moment. So I'm going to go and have a wander out there, probably about a sort of 40 minute walk I think out to the water. And then I'm going to head to the beach after that.
so I've nearly just finished my walk on the salt marsh I'm just almost back at the car um, so next I'm gonna drive up to Wells next to the sea which is about three miles in that direction um, you can see the headland from here um, and I'm gonna sit on the beach for a couple of hours So that's the end of the day. It took me about two hours to drive home. So it's got dark by the time I got home. Um, so I've just come home and sorted the rabbits out. And then it's off to bed. <laughs>